Here you go, finally. I'm live. Let me make sure that my phone doesn't have any sound that will bother you. There you go. Okay, I still don't see myself in the other channel, the Helen Ruth Pinai Pride, but we are on here on the Johnny B channel. So, good evening, good evening, uh, GDR Louis, Supreme Y, Axel F, the Carrot Squad, Spider in the Kinky Boots, why oh, I remember you, Supreme Mimus, Mimus, <laughs> Peter Ian Sager, nice to see you here, who else, Peppa Big Videos, Chester Evergreen, of course, our very own, Another Nile, uh, Fabrizio Delaria, uh, my gosh, I can't read that Roman numeral. 17, 17, so that's, oh, <laughs> I don't think that's right. <laughs> Hello, Chester. Okay. I'm still waiting for the live stream to show up on the Helen Ruth Pinai Pride, but it's not showing. I don't know what is going on. Ah, but I know I'm live. I know I'm live. What's going on? Anyway. Ah, oh, hi, hi, Tyler James. Chester and Niall are co uh, couple guys. <laughs> Hello, Jimmy boy. Nice to see you here. Okay. We have some smart, uh, smart people here right now. So I don't think I have to wait for other people to come. I'm sure that with all the smart mods we have right now, you will be able to guess the word for this uh, TGIF series. The, Thank God it's Friday. Let's just have some fun. <laughs> Hi, Jersey boy. Oh my gosh, it's mod day, moderator day today. <laughs> it's a meetup for all mods. Okay, so we are going to start with the game. Hi there, John Ross. So for those, I think most of you already know how to play this. I am going to... Uh, this is my first word and you are going to guess the word. You will ask me questions that are answerable by yes, no, or maybe. And then afterwards you guess the word. Whoever gets the word gets my hugs and kisses. <laughs> so uh, there are different categories. It's uh, people, place, event, uh, thing. So I'm going to tell you what is the category and then you're going to start asking me questions smart question please and then you will start guessing the game saturday for me have a good weekend miss helen just some gamer thank you thank you hope i win an award at the johnny d awards yep everybody gets an awards okay we will start with the first word the first word i have the first word and it starts right now if you want to guess the word and get a hugs and kisses from miss helen Let's start asking questions. Mm. Hi, E Boy 1104. Still waiting for, for it to show up on the Helen Ruth Pinai Pride. It's not showing. I don't know what's the problem in the other channel. Okay, any questions? Or are you not yet ready to play the game? You want to wait for other people to come? Maybe not. Tyler is just going to listen in the background. Oh my gosh. And you are the smart girl here, Tyler. Chester. Chester has a guess already. Pineapple. No. No, it's not pineapple. What is going on with my other live stream? It's not working. Come on, come on, come on. Why is this not working? Why, why, why? Anyway, how is everybody today? I hope you're having a good time. Tomorrow there's no school, so we can be up late tonight. How does it work? Uh, you're, you're going to ask me with questions that I can only answer with yes, no, or maybe. You are going to guess the word through the... Um, questions that hopefully will lead you to the answer is it an object yes that's a good question chester it's an object 
Hello, I'm gone forever. So you're going to ask me questions about this word that I can only answer with yes, no, or maybe. If you guess it right, you get my hugs and kisses. I like your shirt. Thank you, Simon Cowell. Okay, let's start guessing. Ask me some questions like, is it one word or two word? Is it expensive? Is, is it cheap? Is it found in so-and-so? Yeah, I like Miss Helen's shirt too. <laughs> okay. <laughs> is it red? No. Thank you for the question. Just some gamer. Is it white? No. <laughs> Can I feed it in your mouth? Why do you always have to ask that, Chester? That is one question that you always ask. No, you can't feed it in your mouth. Is it a carrot? No. Is it made out of metal? Mm, no, maybe. Some parts of it, maybe. <laughs> is it soft? No. Is it a type of food? No. Is it a good food? No. <laughs> is it green? No. This is a thing. The categor category is a thing. This is a thing. It's not food. <laughs> Come on, ask the questions. I don't know what's happening in my other channel. Is it larger than one square foot? One square foot? Yes. Larger than one square foot. Good question, Chester. Is it made out of wood from Jimmy Boy? Yes. Is it orange? Hmm, no, maybe, no, 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 no. Is it related to jewelry? No, good question, just some gamer. Do you like it? Hmm, no, not really. <laughs> Do people use it as an everyday item? Very good question, I'm gone forever. No, you don't use it for an everyday item. Is it alive? No, very good question, Nash James. It's not alive. Is it an element of the bisector of the photosynthesis? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> what a question. Is it a bread box? No. What is going on in my other channel? Is it white and warm? No. No, so it is more than one square foot. It is made of wood. Do you have it? No, I don't have it. I don't own one. <laughs> Pillow from Simon Cowell? No. Would it hurt if I kicked it? Yeah, it's going to break. <laughs> no. Don't, you don't want to kick it. <laughs> Do people build with it? Do they build with it? No, not really. Is it something you use at home? No. Nope, nope, nope. Hi there, Karamatsu girl. We have one more who's going to be asking questions. Smart questions, hopefully. A grand piano? No, but good answer, Chester. Is it one word? Yes. Very good, very good question. Does it do something? Yes, it, it creates something. <laughs> from Jimmy Boy. Wooden sword from Minecraft? No. Coffee table? No, it's just one word, Simon Cowell. Is it technology? Mm, no, but sometimes, yeah, maybe the connected mm. te technology. Uh, oh, hello there, Lauren M. Can it float? No. So it's more than one square foot. It's made of wood, maybe a little bit of metal. Uh, is it heavy? No. Good question, just some gamer. Is it a musical instrument? Yes. <laughs> Chester, very good, 
very good question it is a musical instrument can it trigger something else mm. <laughs> oh also from jimmy boy is it a musical instrument yes it is um from simon cowell tv no lauren m violin no hello there zz elemento is it something used for music yes bongos from chester evergreen no viola from lauren m no harmonica from a boy no but you're getting there tambourine from chester no is it woodwind no flute no piano no you're getting there bass no guitar there you go seven ten seven is that your name you got you got it right it's guitar <laughs> there you go we got a winner so hugs and kisses to is that seven ten seven i don't know five i don't know how to pronounce your profile so anyway it's guitar he got it right congratulations there you go now we proceed to our next word our next word come on the next word is a the category is a person people or person people or person let's go what's happening to my other live stream i got you guys musical instruments so i'm pretty much the winner <laughs> yes that's right yeah chester was the one who asked a very important question that led to the answer smarty okay let's go uh to the next word is it one word no from just gamer is it one word no is it female maybe obama no is it joe no obama no male maybe johnny d no simon cowell no trump no me no <laughs> Somebody asked if it's one word. I said no. So it can't be Trump or Obama. Is it a job title? Not really a job, no. Is it PewDiePie? PewDiePie is just one word. Somebody asked if it's one word. I said no. Yoda? No. Is it a name of a celebrity? No. Miss Helen, will you be my friend from Nash James? I'm everybody's friend. Mm. Miss Helen? No. Has it got a child? <laughs> maybe. <laughs> I don't know. Some of them maybe already have kids at that stage, at that point in their life. Hi there, Bradio Pizza. You? No. The category is a person, male maybe, female maybe. So that means it's both. John Wick, no. Are they an athlete? Maybe, some of them could be. Is it a fictional character? No. Felix Kjellberg, that's PewDiePie, no. I said female, maybe, male, maybe. Boomer, no. Is it an actor? No. Are they a real person? Yes. Real person. Is it sometime young? Maybe, yes. Is it homosexual? Maybe, who knows. Caitlyn Jenner, no. Uh, Selena D1, no. Humans, yes, it's a person. The category is person or people. It is uh, male, yes, maybe, female, maybe, so it can be both. So you can answer specific people because they can't be both male or female. <laughs> it's not going to be a specific person if it's male, maybe, or female, maybe. 
So it can be both. If you give me a specific person, no, homeless man, no, <laughs> but that's a good try. Is it Johnny D? No, male maybe, yes maybe, female maybe. So it can be both male or female. Do they write books? No. Mm. So it is a type of people, yes. A group? Mm, no. Maybe. <laughs> If you if they gather together, mm -hmm. trans no. Your favorite singer, whoever that is, no. It's not mm -hmm. a specific person. Teenager maybe. Adult maybe. It's a people. Musician no. Mm -hmm. Certain person. It could be a singer no. Come on guys does it cook no you want to ask where you can see those pe this this person or per people you might want to ask where to find them where you see them do you see them in the I don't know Christian maybe it, no it's not Justin Bieber <laughs> Male may be, female may be, so it can be both male or female. Justin Bieber cannot be both male or female. Politician, no. Is it a group of people? Could be, maybe. Is it Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle? Nice, very nice. Is it career related? Yes, maybe, yes. Uh, serial killers, no. But that's a good answer because it's two words. First of all, it's two words, and it's not a specific person. It could be a mother, it could be an uncle, it could be a, um, you know, it's a person or a people. <laughs> it could be, what else? It could be a bookkeeper, it could be, do they live in Southern or Northern Hemisphere? Maybe. Um, oh my gosh, it could be, what other samples of person could I give you? Um, it could be a baby, education related, yes, very good, Jimmy boy, education related. People, is it two words? Mm -hmm. Yes. Grandpa, no. Mom, no. Dad, no. But those are you know you're, you're getting there but still it is two words mm. minecraft gamers no two words education related maybe male maybe female stepdad is not education related <laughs> but uh nice question stepmom no mm. so it's uh it could be male or female education related two words is it teacher no but a good try but that's not two word we're looking for a two word that may be a male or a female that is education related <laughs> come on guys scientist no mannequin no those are one words we're looking for two words could be male or female mm. education related ex teacher is a good try i'm gone forever that's a good try uh what is the noun i can't answer it. substitute mm. teacher good guess two words education related uh, it, and it's in the category of people or person. Head teacher, that's a good try also, good guess. Transgender male or female, that is a teacher, no. School counselor is a good guess, very good, uh, Tyler James. School counselor, it could be a male or a female, that is education related, that is two words. School principal is a very good guess good guess head teacher no but a good guess from blake cutler college minister good guess 
math teacher, good guess. Vice principal, good guess. We're getting there. We're getting there. Male could be male or female. Education related. Two words, cafeteria person, no. Good guess. Social teacher, no, but good guess. Math teacher, no, but good guess. Why are you focused on the teacher? Besides the teacher, there is the... Not just teachers, we have... What else do we have in the classroom? <laughs> PE teacher, no, but good guess. Again, do not focus on the teacher. Creepy cleaner from Chester. Does it matter what age? Yeah, they could be all ages, so maybe, no, no, not really. Does this person teach a certain subject in school? No, very good question, no. So you can stop guessing, teacher, janitor, no, school tutor, no, students, no, but a good guess from Simon Cowell. It's two words. Math students, no good answer. School students, no good answer. Now we have it. Now it's, it, now it's going. So students, students, what kind of students? We have two words. Student is just one word. We're looking for two words. Could be male, could be female. Is it secondary education related? Yes, very good. Secondary education related. Is it a role within school? Yeah, you could say a role. Um, new kid? No. A dumb child? No. We were already there, almost there with the students. Students. Student council? No, but a good try, Lauren. Band conductor? No. Language students? Good try. Smart students, good try. Hall monitor, we're getting far again. Students, students, students. Class president, no. Exchange student, very good try, very good guess. What other kind of students do we have? Football players, that's going far again. We are almost there. University related, Yes, very good. It's university mm. related. Secondary level. Was it secondary that he asked before? Um, mm. Secondary education? No. Uh, university. Mm. That's even... Uh, oh my gosh, finally. Finally somebody got it. Our very own Tyler James. It's the smarty one. College student. Golly! <laughs> College student. So Tyler James gets the hugs, hugs and kisses. <laughs> hugs and kisses to you, Tyler James, or Silent Amnesia. Congratulations. Finally, somebody got it. College student. There you go. Next, we go to the next. <laughs> we go to the next word. Hopefully, you'll get it right away the next category is a thing it's a thing that was hard work yeah you made it really hard we, we, I kept on saying student student mm. student <laughs> okay the next category is a thing this is a thing so ask questions about a thing <laughs> Is it big? Is it small? Is it cheap? Is it expensive? Is it made of wood, metal, plastic? Can it be found at home or outside the home? Those things. Is it one word, two words, three words? Okay, let's start with the next category, which is a thing. <laughs> okay, I'm leaving now. Love you. Bye, Chester. I know it's really late there. Is it an object? Yes, it's a thing. Is it soft? No. A sock? No. Uh, is it a food? No. Books? No. Kazoo? No. Jewelry? No. Shirt? No. Pants? No. Where is it found? I can't answer you that. I can only answer with yes, no, or maybe. Shoes? No. Is it metal? Yes. Can it be worn? No. 
Food? No. Smartphone? No. Okay, that's the first uh, that's the first clue. Is it it's made of metal? Because Jimmy Boy asked if it is is it made of metal? And I said, Yes. Is it helpful? Yes. Can I fit it? <laughs> Can it fit in your mouth? Oh my gosh, Chester, why do you always have to ask that? No, you can't fit it in your mouth. Do we use it on a day-to-day -day basis? No. Glasses? No. Is it expensive? Mm, yes. Car? No. Microwave? No. Is it big? Yes. TV? No. Is it big? Yes. Is it big? Yes. Oven? No. Bye, Blake Cutler. See you later. Do you have one? Yes, I do have one. Fridge? No. Microphone? No. So it is something big, made of metal, and I have one. Those are the three clues right now. Plane? No, I don't have a plane. <laughs> bus? No, I don't have a bus. Is it technology? No. No, I don't have a plane. Car? No. It is made of metal. It is big. It is something that I have. Computer? No. TV? No. Come on, guys. We're just on the third word. <laughs> is it in your room? No. Clock? No. Is it a tool? No. Minivan? No. Sink? No. House? No. Speaker? No. Speaker is not made of metal. House is not made of metal. CPU? No. Toilet? No. <laughs> Toilet is not made of metal. Radio, no. Come on, guys. We're just on the third third uh, word right now. Car, no. No, no, no. Is it outside? Yes. Very good question, Jimmy Boy. You can find it outside. So it is something that is big made of metal, can be found outside, and I have one of it. I have, I have it. I got one. Actually, I have two or three. Is it used to clean? No. Is it something you see every day? Mm, no, maybe, or some. Iron ingot? What is that? Wrench? No. Fence? No. It is something big, made of metal, can be found outside, and I own one. Ferris wheel? No. Lawn mower? No. Kimstar? No. Gnome? No. Lawn mower? No. Garage door? No. Pipe? No. Fence? No. There you go. Somebody got it. The pig in our attic. The pig in our attic, Congra congratulations, the word is bicycle. There you go, bicycle. The pig in our attic, hugs and kisses to the pig in our attic. Congratulations, congratulations. Okay, the next category is a person. Next category is a person. Come on, guys. We're just on the fourth word. One, two, three. <laughs> the fourth word. Hi there, so Sophie. Hello, Sophie. Hello, hello, Sophie. Uh, okay, let's start with the questions that I can answer with yes, no, or maybe. You, no. Me, no. Ask the very important question first. 
talk show host no daughter no johnny d no son no your husband no jimmy kimmel no these words are hard <laughs> from jimmy boy kimmel no the category is person or people Stephen Hellenberg, no. <laughs> Is it someone related to you? No. Family, no. See, these are good questions now. Famous person, no. I'm waiting for the for the question that Chester usually asks when this category is uh, uh, the category is about person. There's one question that Chester always asks. Celebrity, no. So it's not family, not famous person, not celebrity. You haven't asked if it's first, if it's just a one word or a two word. Workers, yes. Good question. Friend, no. YouTuber, no. Andrew Clements, no, whoever that is. <laughs> Come on, guys. Is it a career type person? Yes, very good question. Very good question, Jimmy Boy. Career type person. Is it a fictional character? No. Boss, no. Office workers, no, but a good answer. Secretary, no. Is it my dad? No. Nobody has asked me if it's one word or two word. Does they work for a business? Yeah, maybe. If it's private, yeah, maybe. <laughs> Businessman, no, but a good try. So it's a career related type of person co-worker no come on guys boss no one or two words you got to be specific if i can only answer with yes no or maybe construction workers no but a good good uh, guess white collar type i don't think this is white collar this is blue collar <laughs> astronauts no wife no is it a hard job yes real estate agent no is it two words yes finally nash james finally uh, nash james asked the important question is it two words made no we're looking for two words that is career related. Markiplier is not a two word, is not career related. Janitor is not a two word. Are they somehow related to you, not family? No, I don't have any of this type of uh, career related thing. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Okay, guys. Career related type of work, um, type of person, two words, karaoke singer, no. Is it a long word? Is it a long two word? Um, yes. Not really. There's the first one, the second one. So, yes or maybe. Johnny D, no, is not career related. Are they in the manufacturing field? Very good question. Radio Pizza, no. Pilot is not two words. Hi there, Bodhi. Hi, Bodhi. We're looking. A police officer, very good guess. Good guess. 
Hydro Gamer YT. That's a good try. Hydro Assassin. Nice to see you. Football player. Good guess. So it's two words. What are the clues right now? It's a career related. It's two words. Tech job? No. Mail carrier? No, but a good try. Good guess. Hi, Grady. Firefighter. Very good guess. Okay, what else? What else? Those types of, of, of people. So we have firefighter. No, it's not, but a good guess. Security guard? No. Is it female type person? Not really. Yes or maybe? Depends. Um, do you know about, you no, know, mm -mm -mm. okay, tech support scammer, no, <laughs> we're getting there, firefighter, Simon Cowell said firefighter, what other type of um, jobs, job related to that thing, police officer, no, but a good try, Fire, fi firefighter, police officer, firefighter police officer they help people what else in that category karate teacher no waitresses is just one word related to the army no army no so it's career related two words Surgery? No. Does this person work for a government role? Yes. Most of them, yes. There are some who are private. But, yeah, I think there's also a lot private, actually. Uh, doctor? No. N nurse? No. Content cop? No. Firefighter? Police officer? Office clerks, no. Ambulance driver, very good try. Ambulance driver, firefighter, police officer, firefighter, police officer, ambulance driver, registered nurses, good guess, good guess. Mm -mm. Secret service, you're, go you're going far. Secret agent, you're going far. We're guessing the category is people or person, career related, could be male or female, um, uh, some of the category, so some other names or, or type of jobs related to it are firefighter, police officer, ambulance driver. Okay, guys, when you call 911, who comes to the rescue? Let's see, you can guess it first. I gave you the biggest clue. 911, what's your emergency? Paramedic is not two words. EMT is not Two words, 911, what's your emergency? <laughs> Firefighter, police officer, ambulance driver, who comes to the rescue when you call 911? 911, they're in a red truck, a fire truck. They carry this uh, thing and are the first ones to come. To help you <laughs> oh my gosh I keep up <laughs> is it the police no when you call 911 911 dispatcher is a good try but they're not actually the ones who come to your house first responder finally finally Jimmy boy got it it's first responder there you go. So Jimmy Boy gets the hugs and kisses. <laughs> hugs and kisses. Hugs and kisses to you, Jimmy Boy. There you go. <laughs> Ambulance person. 
Oh my gosh. Okay, this is an easy one. You should be able to get this right away. This is an easy one. The next category is a place. It's a place. Place, place, place. <laughs> First time for Jimmy Boy. Congratulations. Okay, next category. It's a place. Place. Questions that I can only answer with yes, no, or maybe. That was hard. Yes, it is, Jimmy Boy, but I gave all the... I almost gave the... the <laughs> I gave the, the, the easiest clues. A home... No. Hospital? No. Restaurant? No. Park? No. Garden? No. The thing is, the first question that everybody should be asking is, is it one word or two word? So you won't be wasting your time guessing if it's one word and then all of a sudden then you find out it's two word. Or you're guessing two words, then you'll find out it's you're guessing one word. I gotta go, but have a great day. Thank you. Darkening inside. Grocery store? No. Store? No. Is it the country? No. Is it a place you can buy things? No. Mm. Grocery store? No. Area 51? No. Mars? No. House? No. So mm. the first important question that you have to ask is, is it one word? Is it two words? <laughs> Is it two words or one? I can't answer that. I can only answer with yes, no, or maybe. One or two words, I can't answer that. You got to be specific. Is it one word? Then I can answer that. Is it two words? I can answer that. But if you ask one or two words, I cannot answer that. Car wash? No. Hospital? No. Is it a public area? Yes. You still haven't asked. Is it one? Is There you go from Simon Cowell. Is it two words? Yes. Now I can answer with a yes, no, or maybe. I can only, I can only answer with yes, no, or maybe. So Simon Cowell asked, is it two words? Yes. Is it a place you need to buy to visit? No. Is it one word from Radio Pizza? No. Buy Nash Games. Is it two words from Hydro Gamer Whitey? Yes. Is it one word from Spix? No. Two words? Yes. One word? No. Central Park? No, but a good try. Museum is not two words. We're looking for a place that is also public and it's two words. A place, public, Two words. Pizza Hut? No, that's private. Is it school related? Yes, maybe. Gas station? No. McDonald's is not two words. Town Hall? Very good guess. Post Office? Good guess. Nation Park? Good guess. So now those are two words that can be public. Two words that can be public. Holy crap, crap, it's the incredible Helen. Oh my gosh, how are you? I'm good, Mr. Butler Biscuits. Library is not two words. We're looking for two words that is kind of public. National Park, no. Canteen is not two words. We're looking for two words that is public or can it also be private. Is it big? Yes. School library, no, but a good guess. Library is not two words. Burger King, no. Public library, no, but a good guess. Do you eat there? No, you don't eat there. Public library, no. Schoolhouse, no. You can actually see this. When I said school related, yes, maybe, because 
you can also see this at school but not just necessarily not just the school you can also see this in other places do you eat there no it's a pub it's a it's a big place towards so bad at this our theory car exam is a bunch of illegal what is it sport related use uh, uh, yes is it sport related yes from jimmy boy changing room no playground no that's not two words nurse office no but good guess soccer field no but that's a good guess football field no but that is a good guess it's a place that you can found in the library. It's big, sport related. Hi there, John Ross. Baseball field, no, but a good guess. It's a big place. Could be sport related, found in school maybe. Is it sport related? Yes. Hi, Sister Dakota. Hi there, Sister Dakota. Football stadium, no, but a good guess. We're getting there. Hockey rink, no, but a good guess. What else? Sport related place that you can find in a school. That should be easy. That should be very easy. Swimming pool, no, but a good guess. Computer lab is not sports related. It's a big place that is school related. Rugby field, no. Outside, yes. It's a two word school sports related that can be found in the school. Outside the school, computer lab is not sports related. Parking lot, no, but that's a good guess. Although it's not sport related. We're looking for two words that can be found at school that is sports related. Sports complex, very good, good try. Good guess, Brady or Pizza. Football field, no, but it's a good guess, Lauren M. Come on, who's gonna get my hugs and kisses for this very, very simple word? Basketball court, oh my gosh. Finally, somebody got it from Spix or Spikes. I think it's Spikes. There you go, Spikes. <laughs> Hugs and kisses to you, Spikes. Good job. Congratulations. Finally, it's a simple word, basketball court. Okay, this will be the last one. This will be the last one. The category is person category is person this is our last one ask me questions that are answerable by yes no or maybe this is the last one the category is a person my sister says she likes the turtle on the wall there's a turtle on the wall where's the turtle do i have a turtle I don't see it. Oh, that's not a turtle. That's chicken little. Mm. Isn't that in the gym? Uh, most of the time it's outside. <laughs> Where's the drinking Sunday? Uh, we don't have it right now. Is it two words from Simon Cowell? No. Group? No. Doctor? No. Is it a sexuality? No. Teacher? No. Is it one word? No. Is it genius related? No. Girl? Yes. Boy? No. Women? Yes. Is it a popular person? No. The turtle on the plate on the... Oh, that one. That's a tide clock. It's a tide clock <laughs> so that you will know if it's high tide or, or low tide since I am here near the ocean. Man, no. Male, no. 
YouTuber? No. So we're looking, we already know that it's a woman. It's not one word, it's not two words. Is something related to schools? No. No, actually, the basketball court, there are also mm -hmm. those that are in the, inside the gym. But I've seen a lot that are outside. <laughs> That's a little bit of correction there. There's actually a lot of basketball courts, mm -hmm. though they are in the gym. <laughs> uh, is it a young person? No. Is it three words? Yes. Is it a worker? No. Nurse? No. So we now know that it is a woman. It's not a famous person. It's three words. Can't believe I'm saying this, but stripper. <laughs> no, three words. Is it a title of a woman? Yes. So we now know it's a woman or a female. It's a title of a woman. It is not uh, famous. Is it Melania Trump? Melania Trump is not three words. Is this person white skin? Maybe. Michael Jackson, Michael Jackson is not a three word woman category. Is it a sport or a hobby? No. We're looking for a person. Gold digger? No. <laughs> We're looking for a woman, three words, not famous, but not a gold digger, Simon. <laughs> a woman, three words, gold digger. <laughs> We're looking for a woman, three words, a title of a woman, the first lady, no. Good guess. The first lady, that's three words. <laughs> Hi there, Peter Ian. Hello, penguin.com. Penguin's rule. Okay, guys, this is the last one. Who's going to guess it? It's three words. Woman. Category of a woman. What types of... Uh... Is it the title of a woman? Yes, Jimmy Boy asked that earlier. It's a title. For a woman, Madam Nature, no. Flight attendant is a good guess, but that's only two words. Come on, guys. Who's going to get my final hugs and kisses? A holy nun? <laughs> no, but a good guess. You added A. A holy nun. <laughs> good guess. Do they work? No, maybe, I don't know, some. <laughs> Is it Miss Universe? No. Flight attendant? No. It is three word. Title of a woman or a lady or a girl. <laughs> Not a male. I dropped them. Oh, really, Nash James? You have to say that. <laughs> Musical actor? No. Stay home mom. Very good mm. guess, Brady or Pizza, but that's not what we were looking for. Ice skater? S? No. Nash, incredible job. <laughs> yeah, dropping your toothbrush in the toilet. Okay, guys, come on. What names do you use for woman? What words do you use for woman? Supermodel? No. You are it? No. Come on, guys. When we talk about woman, what's the first thing that comes to your mind as, uh, as far as family is related? Is this person under 60 years old? Maybe. Okay, guys. When we talk about woman, in terms of family, what is the first word that comes to your ma mind? Mm. Mom's cooking. What? Independent women? No. When, we, when I say woman category, girl or female category, 
Mrs. That's good. What else? When in terms of family, woman, what comes to mind? Probably sister, right? Sister, what else? Okay, Nash. Get Nash James, hugs and kisses to you if you have to leave. Mother, of course, mother from Jimmy Boy. When it comes to family and you think of woman, the first the, the first thing that comes to mind is mother. Yes, Nash James, mother. Now, this is a three word, three word. Mother, three words. Mother of children, Bredo Pizza, good guess you're getting there good guess mother of children mother stepsister that's just three uh, that's just two words not three half step mom that's a good try radio pizza three words family related when it comes to women what do you call them Come on, guys. Family, woman, alma mater, <laughs> the good cook, great great grandmother, no, but a good try. Good guess. Come on, guys. When you think about woman in the family, besides mother, housewife, no, ministry of labor, no, mom, aunt, grandma, no, I'm stumped from Jimmy Boy. Think about family, woman, besides mother, what could be a three word? Besides mother. Because mother is just one word. So make it three words. Make that three words. The old the only female that's old. Do you have one? No, she's already dead. <laughs> is it housewife? No. The birth giver? No. Three letter word. You're almost there. Mother. Mother. Mother, mother. I am sick. I call the doctor very quick. Mother. 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 Three words. Mother. A depressed. <laughs> depressed widow. <laughs> mother. One, two, three. Mother. Oh my gosh, you gotta you gotta get this. This is the final word. Mom, no. Mother. Three words. Mother. Mother. Mama spaghetti. No. Mother. Mother. Most of the time, a hated woman. She's not really liked by some members of the family. She's hated. Joe Mama, no. Mother that is hated. Come on, guys, you should get it now. A mother that is hated. Most of the time, hey, Ma oh my gosh, finally, finally, somebody got it. Mother in law, mother in law by seven. Five, I don't know how to pronounce your name. Mother in law, oh my gosh, it took you that long. Mother in law, so hugs and kisses to I don't know how to pronounce your name, seven, ten, seven based on the roman numerals seven ten and seven i don't know hugs and kisses to you <laughs> congratulations you are the smartest one <laughs>
There you go, finally. Put a gun against his head. Pulled my trigger, now he's dead. Mother-in-law, yeah, finally. Okay, guys, thank you so much for, for, for participating in today's Thank God It's Friday. Let's just have some fun. And I did have a lot of fun with you guys. So thank you, thank you so much. From Supreme RY, what does TGIF stand for? It's Thank God It's Friday. And I'll see you again next Friday. Thank you so much for keeping me company, for making me enjoy this segment. I <laughs> really enjoy it. So it's pronounced Vixie or Wix. Oh my gosh. Okay, so Vixie or Wix. Hugs and kisses to you, Vixie. Later, later, everyone. Thanks for joining me. Thanks for par participating. Love you all, guys. See you later. Mwah. Mm-hmm.